Okay, sir. So now what we'll discuss is there is something called MDQ. Any idea, sir? What is MDQ? Multi quality. Multi dimensional code, sir. Multi dimensional code. What is the meaning of multi dimensional code? Multi dimensional code. What is the meaning of this multi dimensional code? For example, I have a cloud storage sir. service. Okay. So this service I want. Okay, you can take a cloud storage. Okay. Service. So they want service, they want a quotation for three years. How many years they want service sir, now? Three years. Customer wants service for how many days? Three years. Okay. So in this case, what we can do is maybe customer can is taking a, like a, for more years he is taking service. So you want like a service based like a, like a when uh, three line items, three line items. But how many products we have? Only one product. One. This product he wants how many how many days he wants service sir? Three years. Three years. Mm. But he wants service for each year. For each year he wants separate a service. Same product we need to divide into the three years. Then how we can achieve this functionality? Not only the years. Example, you want to make it a service like a quarterly. Quarterly ante? Four months. Four months. Or half yearly. What is the meaning of half year service? Six, six months. months. Every six months. Or yearly. Four or months. even you can give a custom dates also. Or you can make it a one time. What is the meaning of one time, sir? Service. One time service ante? ante? You cannot, uh, one renew. time in a lifetime. Yeah, madam. For example, if you take any internet, madam, broadband, okay, either a fiber net or ATL broadband, what you will do, madam, that time? So you will pay for three three months, you will pay advance, correct? Three months advance, you will pay. First three months service, you will pay. Along with, they will charge a one time fee, that is installation fee, example, you can take. Installation fee is how many times you need to pay, madam? Every one time. Quarter, every quarterly? No, no, one time. Only one time. Maybe they will charge a ten dollars example. I'm saying this is called one time. Okay, this is only one time we are going to charge, but this will come automatically every three months or four months or half yearly. How many days you want service? You can take it. This is called what, madam? One port, one product. We are making a dynamic that is called multi-dimensional port. Okay. So if you want to create multi-dimensional port products, there are two important things. After creating a code, we should create a price dimensions. Which object we have to create, sir? Price dimension. Price dimension. So how you want to like a service? So how we are going to charge for that product is, so first time for the cloud storage, one time installation, I'll make it a $10. So this is only one time, sir. This installation fee is only one time. One but time. after that, for this product, I'm going to charge like a yearly wise. So yearly, I want to make it a price equals to uh, $20, example. Yearly, how much, sir? $20. $20. This, this one. So once you configure this one for the subscription products, automatically, automatically, whenever you're selecting service, whenever you're selecting service, based on the term, if you take a 24, automatically, you create a 20, 23 to 24, 24 to 25. If you take three years, Three line items, four years, five at last. So based on the years, automatically the court will divide the line items. Understand, sir? Yes. Hmm. Example, we'll take a cloud storage only. Cloud storage, how much I'm charging per month? Ten dollars. Ten dollars. Ten dollars. So here, and one more thing, these uh, multi-dimensional courts that normally will create for which type of products, sir? Subscription products only. Not for like a standalone all the things. Okay. So here you can see there is something called price dimensions. So here we have to set the price dimension for your product. So here I want to make it a one-time fee. One time, how much I want to charge, sir? Or installation fee, whatever it may be. Installation $10. fee. Uh, $10. This is only one time we need to pay at the time of starting. You can, you can see type yearly, quarterly, monthly, custom, one time. This is one time price. This one time price, how much you want to charge? You can give that price here. How much, madam? $10. Ten That's it. Then click on save and new.
so first we have to create time based uh, things sir first we have to create this time based then only we can create a what one time so i'll make it as a yearly service so yearly service or yearly ramps whatever it may be yearly service so for every year i want to chart service so this is year wise so this price will calculate automatically based on the price book entry so you don't need to give this unit price for this unit price we can use only for one time click a save and new so i have created one year year time service now i'll add a installation fee installation fee is only one time how much i want to charge that price sir 10 dollars click a save so now this subscription product have a two dimensions what is one one time fee and other one is what sir yearly service yearly service hmm. so now what we can do is we'll try to configure this code now we'll go to the code i'll create a new code now What okay, for example, customer one service uh, start date equals to tomorrow, today, 22, 23. They want service for 24. The save. Now go to the edit lines. So now what will happen sir if you choose a cloud storage customer one service 24 months so then how many line items will come now um, two. two three four five uh, two two so why two sir because two years so one one line item for each year mm. Then what about one one time fee is there, na? Installation uh, fee. Where we can how it will come then? Okay, and then another line item. So yeah, two years and then one installation fee. So. Correct. This is an installation fee. One time, how much you are charging, sir? Here. Ten, Ten dollars. This is yearly one. So this is why one twenty dollars is coming, sir. Per month, I am charging Ten dollars. Ten dollars. So twenty four uh, per year one. How much you are charging now? One twenty. One twenty. Year two, how much? If you give so thirty six months, one year three will come here, sir. Correct, that's correct. Because we are charging yearly wise price, right, ma'am? No price dimension. Yes. For this product, yearly wise we are giving, right? If you make it a uh, half yearly wise, what will happen? How many will come now? Half yearly means six. how many lines? Six lines will come. Six. Quarterly, quarterly. Understand what is now this yes. same product? If you click here, same product. This is the first time we need to pay ten dollars at the time of installation. This is only one time fees. Okay, so remaining yearly wise, you are so even you can give some discount, madam. So first year you can give a ten percent discount. Second year you can give a twenty percent discount. Right, ma'am. Third year you can give a some discount. So that customers also will happy. Okay, year wise I am getting more discount. They will take they will take more service. Yes or no? Right. True. Yes. So like this, you can click on storage. Now, if you click on save, tell me how many line items will create, ma'am. Now, one line item or four line items or three line items? Six. Four. Four. Why four, sir? What is one time? Three years and one insul installation fee. No, four no. line items. Correct, ma'am. But we gave yeah, half yearly, right, sir? There? No, ma'am. Yearly half given. Thirty-six. Yearly half given half yearly. Here we are giving yearly service, right? But if you click yearly service, okay. Okay. here you can choose a type is equal to what you have selected now. Yearly. If you choose here uh, six, sorry, off, you will get a six by automatically. Quarter, monthly, custom, one time. Here, off yearly is not there. Quarter, monthly, or you can choose this custom. Okay. Understand, madam? Okay. Sir. So now total four line items. Even if you open, sir, you can understand clearly. Like when to when it will start, when to when it will end. Right? Hmm. Right. Start and end date also you can see now. 
So this is a coat line item. It is starting with the episode, sir, 23 and end with when, sir, 24. 22. Oh, yeah, 22. This is year one. So next, what will come? Year two. In the year two, what will come, sir? It will start with 23. 24. 24. Year one, after year I one. I mean, okay, okay, okay. Then 25. 25. Second service. Then third service. 25, 26. 25, 26. It will come. Where is that? Ah, 25. Yeah. And one more. This is one time. For that, you will not get any start date and date. Why? This is only one time. Understand, sir? Right. Yeah. Bye. So this is called multi-dimensional code. You can generate a code dynamically with the different lines by adding a price dimensions. Yes, sir. Yeah. This is yeah. called multi-dimensional code. But here, important question, sir. I mean, what we discussed till now is only one primary code is for one opportunity. You cannot create more than one primary code. Primary code. One opportunity. So whenever you set the primary code checkbox, what will happen, sir? That becomes the primary uh, code for the opportunity. Current primary select code. primary code. So automatically those lines will go to the where sir? Goes to opportunity line. Item. Opportunity line. Item. And okay. So generally opportunity products we cannot add here, sir. Automatically opportunity products will create based on the primary code. In this Salesforce right. CPQ, in the Salesforce CPQ, we cannot create uh -huh. opportunity products. How this opportunity products will come? Automatically, for opportunity, whatever the primary code is selected, that primary code line items only will go to the opportunity products. Understand? Right. Yeah. Okay. If, you, if you change primary code again in the opportunity, again it will replace again. It will change again. So these two are very right. important questions. Okay. That's one, and let's make it one. 